In this video, I'm gonna show you how ChatGPT and KV Core combined can revolutionize your business in 2023. Let's go. First, let's talk about ChatGPT. You've probably been hearing a lot about it over the last few weeks. And if you're in the real estate or mortgage business like myself, you might be wondering how you can incorporate this into your everyday workflow to be more productive. Okay, before I move on, if you're interested in getting more information on artificial intelligence and how it relates to the real estate and mortgage business, then hit the like and subscribe button and the bell notification icon so that you can be notified every time I make videos just like this one. I'm trying to grow this channel. I think this is a very, very important topic that all of us in the real estate and mortgage business and in the tech industry in general need to pay close attention to. Okay, so what exactly is ChatGPT? ChatGPT is a AI tool that's really designed to streamline communication. And it's also designed to create human-like text. That's one of the main reasons. Now I asked ChatGPT, like, what is your purpose? And matter of fact, let's look at what it told me its purpose was. ChatGPT says its main purpose is to generate human-like text, which makes it particularly well-suited for natural language understanding and generation tasks. So let's just stop right there. Generating human-like text. This is powerful because it now allows us to employ bots like personal assistants. So we can save a lot of time and energy from having to write blogs, newsletters, and emails on a daily basis. This is a game changer. Other features of ChatGPT, obviously it's in the name, it was designed to create human-like chats. So like we see some of the bots like ManyChat over the years that will automatically respond to clients and customer service requests. Well, that's one of the reasons ChatGPT was created as well. So again, streamlining communication in a human-like text format. Now, as it relates to KV Core, if you're in a real estate business, you may have heard of KV Core. If you have not heard of KV Core, there's a lot of information on KV Core online, and you can check out this video here. This guy does a really good job of talking about KV Core and kind of explaining its benefits. But for this video, I want to speak to you specifically about how I'm using KV Core and ChatGPT to generate more leads. More leads equal more money, right? And that's what we all want. We're trying to get leads in this business, prospects, people to talk to. So we can generate an online presence by the use of uh, newsletters, emails, and blogs, then that's all the better. Also, it helps with SEO. Now with KV Core, you get a personalized website that includes a blog. So a lot of people aren't aware of the blog feature inside of KV Core, and that's what we're gonna take advantage of. So I'm gonna demonstrate that right now so you can see exactly how you can use ChatGPT along with KV Core to generate more business. All right, guys, so we are going to get into this. The first thing I want you guys to do, we're going to open up four tabs. Uh, we're going to open up a KV Core tab. We're going to open up a Chat GPT tab, a Quillbot tab, and I'm going to want you to open up a Canva tab. Now, hopefully you have a Canva account that you can do this with. Um, if not, you can probably grab images from anywhere. It, I just like Canva because it's pretty convenient, and I can type in the image kind of that I want. Um, pretty soon I'll make a video about adding images using chat GPT. That way we can generate the images right away. But for starters, if you don't have a chat GPT account, you're going to want to go to openai.com, openai.com. And you're going to want to scroll down to the login section. And here is where you're going to go ahead and, uh, log in using Google, or you're going to log in using your email. I'm already logged in. I'm already logged in, so I won't do that. I'm gonna close that one. I'll just leave it open. So here, um, this is the Jet Chat GPT setup, right? So you can see I've already kind of searched some real estate topics. And again, we're creating blogs. This is gonna be very, very helpful for us to get our name out there and get some SEO going surrounding our brand. All right. So the next thing I want you to open up is uh, a tab. Open up a separate tab and we're going to go to quillbot.com. So quillbot.com, this is a great AI tool for paraphrasing uh, paragraphs. Um, we're not, we're, this is the free version. So there's no pay for, to get started here. You can upgrade and I think it gives you more paragraphs, but for our purposes, all we need is a few paragraphs and we'll be great. And I'll show you that in just a second. So I want to see chat GPT opened up. And then I want you to get a Quillbot opened up. 
The next tab that I want you to open up is KV Core. So assuming you already have a KV Core account, you should log into your KV Core account. And the section that we're gonna go into is the blog section. So once you're in the KV Core account, you're gonna to wanna to come down here to uh, Website Manager and go into the blog section. So Website Blog. Once you get into the Website Blog section, you're going to add post. All right, so this is where we want to be at, right? This is where we start. We wanna add our post, have our KV Core year. We can go to Chat GPT and we have Quillbot set up. And then I'll bring in on another slide uh, the Canva setup. I may be able to do it from here. Let me see if I can log into Canva. Make it a little simpler. Because what you're gonna do in Canva, you're gonna be able to grab your images and it's gonna be really convenient just grabbing images out of Canva. So let's see what we got here. Um, let's go here. Okay, so yeah, you can grab images. I'm already kind of in here. And let's close this just so you can see what it looks like. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna wanna do once we have our tab set up, we are going to go into, we have our blog here, we have our chat GPT here, we have our Quillbot here, and then we have Canva. Let's put Canva next to Quillbot. This is just a simple workflow so that you can be quick about getting your blog post out. Um, I timed it and I was able to get a blog post out, you know, in about six minutes, five and a half, six minutes on average, depending on how cute I want to get. Maybe I'm adding bold uh, letters or changing some, some paraphrasing. Um, so that's kind of how that works. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is go into Chat GPT. And in Chat GPT, I'm going to tell it to give us some high ranking titles. So I want to start off with some high ranking titles and then I'll take those titles and build my blog around that. So let's say um, write a high ranking title titles for home sellers. Let's get specific in California. Let's say in California. So high ranking blog titles. Right, high ranking blog titles, or maybe a few high ranking blog titles for home sellers in California. That looks good. All right, so we'll go there and see what it comes up with. All right, so it's going five tips for selling a home in California fast, the top 10 things California home sellers need to know. So, this is all good stuff, right? So, what I'm going to do while it's writing, if I'm trying to do this really quick, I'm going to grab one expert advice how to get the best price for your California home, right? So we're gonna take that, we're gonna copy that title, and we're gonna to go to KV Core and add that to the title section. Now, what I like to do is go ahead and put some SEO uh, extras in there with my name, my company's name, and advisory, and then the city that I'm in. So I'm gonna say Orange County Market News and Updates. Right, so I'll take that title, copy it, because you're gonna see how we're gonna use it later. Boom, I'll just drop it right there. I'll delete this portion of it and leave it, right? So the next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go back into ChatGPT. We're gonna take one of this title. So this is the title we chose. So what we're gonna do is paste in the title that we like. And that was uh, expert advice, how to get the best price for your home, for your California home. So. Let's go ahead and see what it generates for that. So here are a few tips to help you get the best price for your home in California. Now, a lot of these tips are probably coming from Zillow and other sites that are high ranking on the web. Remember, we asked for high ranking titles. So these titles should be pretty good SEO content. And then what we're gonna wanna do while it's building it out I'm going to take a paragraph and we're going to go to our Quillbot, right? So Quillbot is where we're going to paraphrase our paragraphs. This is going to customize our content. That way our blog does not get flagged by Google for being created by a bot. And it's always a good idea anyway, just to go in here, reread some of this stuff, make sure you like the way it sounds, make sure it sounds like you. 
and um, before you go ahead and post it. So for this example, I'm going to go ahead and just drop it in here so you can see how this is done. And as you can see, that's one paragraph down. Now it's still creating paragraphs, so I can just go down the line, pick however many I want, depending on uh, the size of the information. Oop. I'm supposed to go here. We paste it there, paraphrase, and then we continue to do that. So let's do this. We copy, we go to KV Core, we paste that in there. So now we have two paragraphs, right? Go back to chat GP3, and we can probably grab two. So let's take paragraph three and four, see if they'll fit. So you have limited words here in Quillbot. I think it's the max is like 120. So you can get a couple paragraphs in here, and this is the free version. So you don't have to pay to be able to use this software. And this is also an AI, um, an AI tool that you can use, right? To paraphrase, to make things your own after you get the outline from ChatGPT. So we're moving right along. Let's grab five and six and drop those into Quillbot. And this should, I think we have one more paragraph left. Now, typically you're gonna want to, like I said, read through these, make sure they sound like you and um, change, change a couple things. Even in a paraphrase, I like to change stuff around just to make it my own. It's always a good idea to do that. It may take you a, t a little bit longer, you know, up six minutes, seven minutes, but it's worth it to get the quality content out you know, in a short amount of time. So this is this is huge, people. All right, so I just copied that and I'm gonna paste it. Okay, so now we have our blog built, right? We have the text of our blog built out. So what I like to do sometimes, and this could take, make it, you know, this could take a little bit longer. So what I like to do is sometimes I'll go in and just kind of bold out some of the titles, right? I, I, I just think that it makes it look better and easier to read. So I'll go in when buyers express interest in your home, be prepared. So I may say, be prepared to negotiate and just bolt that out. In general, it could be quite beneficial to work with a knowledgeable local real estate agent uh, to guide you through the home selling process. And then I may just change this around. A good agent will be knowledgeable about the neighborhood. But for now, I'll just leave it so we can move on with this demonstration. And then I like to, I like spacing, but maybe not that much spacing. And then we'll do it like this. I'll bold out the title. Now, the next thing that I'm gonna to do to just to bring it all together, I like to bring in images. So I use Canva. So I can go into Canva and go into elements and say, what are we talking about, right? We're talking about home sellers, selling homes. So let me type in home seller, which is really homes for sale. So you get all these images for people selling their homes or just sold their homes. Let me, let me do a just sold. Yeah, here we go right here, so for sale. So I'll go over here to Canva, drop the image that I like in there. So let's see, where was it at? So that's a pretty good image. Um, and then I'll cut and paste that image. Once I cut and paste this image, I'm able to go right to the blog, click on the image section, and then I'm gonna drop that image right in there, right? So home for sale. So what I like to do is go ahead and add the URL in there. So this is a link to a seller valuation form because I'm driving traffic from the blog to my landing pages. So that's what we're doing here. And I like to go ahead and have them open it in a separate window. All right, and there you have it. So you'll have the image right there, the blog title, and you'll have all the blog content. And that was really fast. And then what I'll do to finish it off, I'll do a call, I'll put a CTA, a call to action right here at the bottom. So I'll say, uh, see what your home is worth in today's market. Click here, click here to see what your home is worth in today's market, All right? And then, and then I'll go ahead and make this a link, a clickable link. So I can highlight it, go right here to links, drop the URL in there, and then click next window, and I'll come back and add the same title. So we'll take 
the title right there. We'll go back to the link and then we'll add this title. Remember, we're trying to get high ranking SEO and drive traffic to our blog or to our funnels once we post these blogs. So that's what you see here. And at this point, you're done. You can go ahead and schedule this thing out right on the date that you want to send it out and press publish. I'm going to save it as a draft for now because I want to go back through it and maybe make sure it, it sounds like how I want it to sound in terms of, you know, coming from me directly. But that's it, people. You can do this as many times as you need to. This will help to get your name out there and get you some SEO juice behind your landing pages and behind your name in general. All right. So this is what it looks like on the front end when we go to the uh, KV Core blog. Right. So clients log in on the front end and this is where your blog will show up. So we have our image here. We have all our text. We even have a, a link You can click that link that we put in there and it'll send the clients to the blog or send the leads to the blog so that you can capture their information. And that's pretty much how it's done. I think I even put a link in the image as well. So, yep, link in the image so you can link the images. And this, again, is the front end of the KV Core site. And this is amazing. So guys, take full advantage of this. I think this is something that everybody can benefit from by using ChatGPT to speed up our workflow. So we all know that writing content takes a lot of time and energy, but now with this new AI revolution and softwares like ChatGPT, we're gonna be able to cut our workload in half. Okay guys, that's it for me today. If you found any value in this video, please leave a comment below, hit the like button, subscribe, or hit the bell notification icon so you can see more videos like this in the future. All right, so thanks for staying to the end. You guys enjoy the rest of your day. Peace.